Today we are going to be repairing stucco cracks. If your home has stucco on the exterior, chances are you have seen some hairline cracks like this. It's very easy to fix and we're going to do it today. We use this Alex Plus acrylic latex caulk. It has some silicone in it so um, should expand once it gets into the joints. Easy cleanup and can be painted within about 30 minutes so let's do it. All right, so you're going to want to put it in your caulk gun, cut the tip at about a 45 degree angle. The smaller you cut the tip, the easier it will be to get into some of these hairline cracks. Um, I have a little clog there, but essentially what you're going to do is apply it directly into or onto the crack the best you can. Um, and then take your finger and just cram it in there. Depending on what type of texture you have on the outside, you can see I have a pretty heavy texture. Um, it's going to require going multiple different directions a few different times and passing over it a few different ways. Um, eventually getting into the swirls is probably going to be the best just to make sure that every um, crack and every portion of that crack gets filled. Then you're just going to take a pretty wet rag and wipe off the excess. If you don't wipe off the excess, it's going to leave the, um, I mean, it's a silicone, so it'll dry and uh, you'll be able to see exactly where you applied all of the uh, all of the caulk and where it started to smear. So this is another crack doing the same thing. Once again, just lining uh, your caulk up with the hairline crack, filling it in. It, this can be done for anything up to, they say, about the size of a quarter. So if you have a, a crack that's a little bit larger, um, you may want to use a specific stucco repair or, uh, or mortar. But all you're going to do is fill it in and then wipe off uh, all of the excess again use a clean portion of the rag keep the rag pretty wet um, and you may need to do this one or two times depending on the depth of, of the crack and just to make sure that you get it all in uh, you do want to clean it first um, just to make sure there's no dust or debris in there uh, this is a, another horizontal crack that we've got at the house and uh, again you can see with such a heavy texture it's a little bit difficult to uh, just run your finger directly across to get uh, to get it all in but this is essentially all we're going to be doing and um, again if it doesn't all it, it may sink a little bit so you may need to do this once it dries it may the caulk may sink a little bit so you may need to do it um, a second time around but once that dries, this dries within 30 minutes, I waited a day and came back. And it's a little tough to see the line, um, but there it is. And you're just going to paint over it. We've got some house paint, hard to, to really see it there. But coating the, um, the hairline crack with, uh, with the paint is all that you need to do now. And then hopefully it is completely gone. You can see once we bring it in there, I can't see uh, can't see the line at all. And same thing here. You can kind of see that white uh, portion of the uh, of the caulk and where it was smeared. And now we're just going to go over it. The house isn't white. It's actually called a toasty gray. So um, so you can get clear caulk or gray or any other color that you think might help, um, but. You can see as soon as I done painting it, uh, the paint's not even dry yet, and you can see um, no more crack. So that's it. Very easy fix, and um, look forward to uh, helping you guys out here in the future.